the Biden campaign, is based on a divisive lie. Close your eyes, remember what you saw on television. Close your eyes, remember what you saw on television. Well, close your eyes, remember what those people looked like coming out of the fields carrying torches. And remember seeing those neo-Nazis and Klansmen and white supremacists coming out of the fields with lighted torches, veins bulging. Their veins bulging. These white supremacists, Nazi sympathizers, carrying Nazi fags, flags. And spewing the same, same anti-Semitic bile. Used as it was used in Germany in the 30s. And remember what the president said when asked? And asked the president, what do you think? He said something no president has ever said. And remember what the Mark president down, said when asked? Said. He said there were, quote, there were very fine people, people on both sides. On both sides. And you had some very bad people in that group. But you also had people that were very fine people on both sides. You had people in that group, excuse me, excuse me, I saw the same pictures as you did. You had people in that group that were there to protest the taking down of to them a very, very important statue and the renaming of a park from Robert E. Lee to another name. <laughs> so George Washington was a slave owner. Was George Washington a slave owner? So will George Washington now lose his status? Are we going to take down? Excuse me. Are we going to take down? Are we going to take down statues to George Washington? How about Thomas Jefferson? What do you think of Thomas Jefferson? You like him? Okay, good. Are we going to take down the statue? Because he was a major slave owner. Now we're going to take down his statue. So you know what? It's fine. You're changing history. You're changing culture. And you had people, and I'm not talking about the neo Nazis and the white nationalists, because they should be condemned totally. But you had many people in that group other than neo Nazis and white nationalists, okay? And the press has treated them absolutely unfairly. Donald Trump clarified within 60 seconds he wasn't talking about the neo-Nazis. Joe knows. Joe is exploiting division and racial issues for his own political gain. Don't be like Joe. Be better.